do you feel about your work? That was the question asked by HWORK, a European project aimed at promoting the mental health of workers in small and medium-sized enterprises and in the public sector. In the first phase of the project, the preparatory phase, the partners conducted a needs assessment in the five intervention sites, two in the public sector and three in the SMEs. In total, 24 senior managers, 28 middle managers, 162 employees participated in the needs assessment. After conducting 21 focus groups with workers and 52 face-to-face -face interviews with managers, the HWORK project was able to identify the needs of employees and employers of the participating organisations. In the second phase of the project, the implementation phase, partners of the project designed and implemented interventions with a multi-level approach, the individual dimension, the group dimension, the leadership dimension, the organisational dimension, Unibo, in collaboration with Ausler, the local public health authority in Bologna, implemented five types of interventions. Uji implemented a total of five types of interventions, in collaboration with two Spanish SMEs, Inoceuve Solutions and Factor. TUB carried out three types of interventions within its university. QED, finally, carried out five types of interventions at eye level. What have the results shown so far? It is important to improve understanding of mental health and well-being at work and reduce stigma, thus encouraging help-seeking behaviour in employees. 56% of Inoceuve participants perceived a positive attitude towards mental health in the organisation. At Factor, 81% of participants perceived a positive attitude towards mental health in the workplace. Interventions need to be well designed, accepted by employees and transferable. Ausler Bologna Healthcare Workers reported that the interventions were transferable, acceptable, usable and well designed. Moreover, after the interventions, 80% of healthcare workers reported being satisfied with the interventions. At Factor, 77% felt they were able to put into practice the knowledge that they had gained during the interventions. In the Spanish sites, 82% of employees felt they had the opportunity to adopt new behaviours at work. Individual interventions and one-to-one -one relationships allow employees to build skills to manage stress. One-to-one -one coaching was a popular type of intervention at TU Brunswick. After the interventions, 82% of participants had a better understanding of mental health and well-being issues. At eye level, participants were satisfied with the interventions from QED and found mindfulness interventions helpful. At the end, 65% of the staff also reported that they were able to apply the knowledge gained through the mindfulness interventions. At a time when worker burnout and turnover are major problems, we can reduce both offering innovative interventions and redesigning work in ways that promote employee well-being and health. HWORK is showing that multi-level interventions can have synergistic effects. Let's have an impact on workplaces' health and well-being.